The theme for this sectional semifinal is firsts for Matia Valley and Yorkville. The Mustangs make their first ever sectional appearance after clinching the regional title, while the Foxes are back in the sectionals for the first time since 2007. Matia is up 3-2 in the first set, and it's Kira Hudson making an impact. She gets the pass from Reagan Homer and smacks it to the other side. It's a two-point lead. Mustangs up 8-4, but here come the Foxes. Homer tries to send it back, but the Black and Red are able to return. Janelle Pye Blacknard spikes the ball that bounces off Morgan Rank for the kill. That cuts the deficit to three. Eight point lead for Matia and we got a rally. Each team is going back and forth trying to secure the point. Once the Mustangs get it, it's Emma Bludgeon setting up Annabelle Troy for the kill, giving her team a 17-8 advantage. Set point Matia Valley. An error on the Foxes gives the Black and Gold a 25-14 set one victory. One set away from the finals. However, in the second set, Yorkville is a different team. It's Pie Blacknard getting the easy kill and a 4-2 advantage. Fox is up three, but Matia isn't going anywhere, especially when Hudson is on the court. After her team gets the ball back, she rises for the spike and cuts the deficit to 10-8. It's a one-point Yorkville lead. Ella Borku smashes it to extend the lead to two. We are tied at 14 with momentum on the Mustang side. Hudson and her teammate Hallie Sullivan form a wall for the rejection to retake the lead. And they don't look back from there. We have a long rally, but Reagan Homer caps it off. She blocks Pi Blacknard's kill attempt, and Matia leads 21-19. Match point for the Mustangs, Yorkville can't get the return, and Matia moves on to the sectional finals for the first time in school history. They will take on Plainfield North in the finals after a straight set win over the Foxes. We just really try to play our game and focus on our side. That's what's been working for us all season, no matter what the other side is doing, no matter if they're making mistakes or if they're like getting a lot of tools on our block, we just have to focus on our side and make sure that we're doing what we need to do. It's super nerve wracking, especially coming into it and never having gotten this far, knowing that we're just, there's really high expectations for us, but it's really just a rush of energy. And I think we're all just pushing each other through it and we have hopes to go super far. Well, we are proud of the way we played in that game and we're proud of the way we've been playing all throughout playoffs. And we know there's still more to unlock in our potential and we want to keep peaking throughout playoffs. But we all work so hard in practice and we all have such similar goals that we're all working towards every day. It's our first ever trip to it. I mean, I really want to make history at this school. It's something that's always been important to me. So I'm just really excited for that.